What's up, y'all? Come on in. About to get some dinner together. Um, we're gonna make. Um, actually, I went to this place called Esoteric, right? My wife and I. We went about twice, and they have this scallop dish that's on the menu that I love. But I wanted to make a different version of it. Um, they make a, uh, a a seared scallop, and it's over a mushroom risotto, and it has a miso black sesame sauce and some blistered tomatoes and some pickled leeks we're gonna make our version of that um we're gonna do a little bit different um just i like to twist it around and and and, and change things up every once in a while we're gonna use um we're gonna bake some rice um instead of making risotto i think we're gonna still get a kind of creamy rice from that uh, my idea is to uh, take some cream of mushroom soup uh, a little parsley, a little onion, a little garlic, a um, little, little, little mushroom, and some rice. Um, we are going to put that in with about a cup and a quarter of beef stock. We're going to set that in the um, oven. We're going to cut up about a stick, yeah, whole stick. I know it's not, it's not, not healthy stuff. Whole stick of butter in there. Um, so we're going to have a nice buttery, creamy, rich. Um, almost risotto like baked rice okay and we'll finish it off with a little shade parmesan reggiano um for our sauce um uh, i thought of maybe doing doing a green sauce so i'm thinking about doing i roasted some garlic um we have some anchovy paste you can use anchovy in the can um this is gonna this is just milder and less fishier so you can get it in the tube also a little lemon juice a little chopped parsley a little um coconut milk yep coconut milk and to give it some creaminess and we're going to uh, drizzle some olive oil in there just for the just for the green uh, garlic anchovy sauce I'm going to try to pickle quick pickle some leeks um, I'm really inclined to maybe use uh, green onion because I think I'm going to get a little pickling quicker because the you know the green onions are a lot thinner and less tough uh, than these bad boys here they're like almost like bamboo leaves so I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna make my, my mind up in a second how I'm gonna do that. But the pickling sauce that we're gonna use, a real simple pickling, we, we, I just have some apple cider vinegar, and got a little water, got a little agave sweetener, you can use honey or sugar, or whatever you want. Um, a little bit of dill, I'm gonna put in there a little salt, I got a little dry mustard, and a little red pepper flake, simple. I got my, um, my scallops that are nice and um, at room temperature now, I let them uh, come to room temperature and then we're going to just pat them dry they will caramelize a little better when they're warm and when they are dry so that is our deal today y'all it's good to have you all let's start our theme music so we can get the going in this kitchen uh-huh oh somebody turned my volume down jesus well that's better What's up, Kim, Joanne, Barbara? Good to see you. Stella, Stella. Dorothy Johnson's here. Oh, well, okay. Well, that's how you're going to do laptop? You're just going to stop it like that? That's, that's you just going to say saute and then stop. Lord Jesus. Oh, oh, that's because I closed it. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm the worst, guys. Uh-huh. Errol and Gail, how's it going, everyone? Good to have you guys here. Anita, I actually ran to the store with my sister. Um, I've already preheated the oven to about 425. I want to get it at a nice high heat because we're going to be baking all these liquids and allowing this, this rice to cook. So I want to make sure it's at a higher heat there. It should be super, super simple um, that even a boy can do it. So... Good to have you all, Deb, hey, hey, Martina, Unity, good to have y'all. So let's get this together, um, real simple, like, I'm going to grab out some stuff, and hopefully Daryl is on the way to cameraman me. I'm hoping and I'm praying and I'm praying and I'm hoping. Got a little, I hope I have enough beef stock, didn't even check to see how much was left in here. Ah. 
But how is everyone? Margaret, hello, 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 hello. Good to see you all. Going to get... Mm, I might have to actually... I think this is the last of my stock. I only need... You know what? I don't even need that much. I need a, about a cup and a quarter. I think I'll pull some of this out. Derek, can you do this? Are you able to do it? Yes, you're good, boy. You're good. All right, let's see where we at. Quarter. I'm going to put a little more liquid in there. Just a little more. And then the recipe I typed out already, guys. So don't even fret. The recipe is on our website already, all right? Uh, that's a little too much. A little bit more. A little bit more. I just want to make sure I don't have too much liquid in there. I want this all to dry out here. A little bit more. All right. I think we're good there. I think we're good there. Okay. So a little, little beef broth. What's up, Margaret? Unity. Good to have everyone. Thank you for the 50 stars. Whoever sent that. Uh, Donna G. Leon. Good to see you, my man. Uh, what's up, Elvira from Waukegan? Good to have you also. So let's do this, y'all. Let's let's make this happen, okay? Y'all okay with that? Um, Georgine, good to see you also. All right, let's go ahead and start putting this together. I got a bacon dish here that I'm just going to actually, you know what? I got a whole thing that goes over this. And I don't know where I did with it, but we're going to use this cookboard for now. To use that as a surface. I'm knocking stuff over, y'all. Boom. Okay. Super simple. I'm going to give the cameraman. Here you go, cameraman. You ready, cameraman, for me? Uh, yeah. Um, I'll probably need to scroll for the to scroll. Okay. I'm scrolling bad. Uh, what's all of this? All right, people. I ain't too loud today. Got a slight little headache, so. But how are everybody doing? That's a whole lot of scrolling. Wait a minute. Uh, yeah, I might have missed a few people. Uh, yeah, a, a lot of people. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of people. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. How you doing, Stella Jack? <laughs> Gail Carter, I see you. All right, now we're starting to delete people real quick. Dorothy Johnson, how you doing? Um, Courtney, yeah, mommy eats some mushrooms. She just don't know it yet. Yeah, she don't know it yet. Uh-huh. She don't know no better. How you doing, Martina Whitfield? Unity, one of my favorite names. How you doing? How you doing, Kimberly? Yolanda Messi, hey. Leon Gibbs, what's going on with you? Correction, Leon DeRold Gibbs, okay. That's a new one. Elvira Hayes, how you doing? Hey, what are more? Hold, hold on, people, hold on. Let me turn this thing down real quick. I got you. You, got you, it? you can All talk right. to him while. All right, people. Let me see. No, I'm not showing my face today. Got a bad mustache day. <laughs> how you doing, Liz Jones? Hey, Betty White. Betty White. <laughs> Get a little garlic in there. Mm -hmm. A little mushroom, a little onion. Rita Anderson. A little bit of that parsley. Hey, Nisi. Getting that rice in here. And this is another simple one, guys. You know, we like to come up with the simple recipes. Super easy, even boy can do it. We're going to add our broth in here also. We're going to mix all that together. How you doing, Haley? And then we're going to just... Let that be. Shuana Ben, I hope I said that right. If I didn't correct me. And Cynthia Neal, you made a barbecue salmon, corn salsa, mango, and rice tonight. But did you post a picture? Even though you used our seasonings, though, you used it. <laughs> hey, Denise Williams. And Clarissa Thompson, give me one second. The cutting board is actually from oh, barely even up. Actually, there. this cutting board is not, but the cutting board that we normally use. Is yeah, from Nick this Cowan's. one. I don't know where this yeah. one came from. This one we got uh, years ago from uh, a shop right. 
I think it was in the clearance section and they didn't have a price on it and I, I went to the manager and I was like hey you know how much is that uh that cutting board I sure would like to have it if you but you don't have a price on it and I'm, I know a cutting board like this is over 50 bucks so I was like oh it's bamboo so I was like he said well uh, would you pay like 20 and I said I would pay like five and then he said cool five dollars literally how I got this all right so we're gonna put this actually I'm gonna put some aluminum foil Tracy on Bailey thank you for the 50 stars show them what we got there now before we um Oh, I forgot the most important thing, guys. Joshua Genzel, how are you doing tonight? the most tonight? important thing. It's Carly Crumb, what's going on? She not done, y'all. Mm -mm. Tosha Black. She not done. We're going to use some salt. We're using a whole so stick. Let's see who I got it here. Of butter. Sorry. Judge yourself. Don't judge me. Judge yourself. We got a Rita Anderson, Mary Ballou, Joanne Smith, Ooh. Janice Body. Yeah, well, he Andrew. just did that. Peggy, what's up, Peggy? Mary Louis Donald Perry, okay. Jackie Williams, Deborah Brown. I already said you, Stella Jack. You don't get too many shout outs, Stella. Pamela Colbert, I see you. Margaret Burkett, okay. Alexis Bladden, how you doing? Y'all, this is some fat people food right here. This is straight <laughs> fat people food, I'm telling you right now. Living it's my be best so life lane, what's going on with you? Tamaro, I see you. Yeah, that is right, Tamaro. Ain't that the name somebody from Fast and Furious, right? Who? Tamaro. If I'm not mistaken, I think that's my boy's um kid's name named Tamaro. Or Toretto. Toretto, that's just Toretto. Toretto, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was his last name. Yeah, you're right. Carolyn Marshall, I see you. Susie Linton, how you doing? Eleanor Harris. Granny Bacon, what's going on, Thank Granny? <laughs> I love that name. <laughs> what's this? Tasha Simmons Rice. Monica Shorts. Whoa, 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 what is this? Lodi, hmm. Consequeo? Lodi Consequeo? Has I said that right? Hopefully, L O I D E. I got that con C E I C A O. So if I said that right, let me know. Sharon Jenkins, how you doing? Nisi Pillway. I think I said your name already, Nisi. I think I did. Leslie Phillips. Made me try this one. Kuwana Skaber. Skaber. Okay. Hopefully I said your name right, Kuwana Skaber. Julia Robinson from the UK. Welcome back. This is going in the oven. And don't forget um, the recipes on our website. Um, 425 I'm thinking for I'm gonna put I'm gonna keep it in here for about 30 minutes on the uh, 30 minutes on uh, covered and then about maybe 15 20 minutes uncovered so let me just let this go ahead and do its thing at this high temperature how you doing Vanette with that Vanji ooh I know that last name too but I keep messing it up it's already skipped now what's so yeah, I know, I know how to say it, but I keep always like bite my tongue a little bit. Is that Murtris Thomas? How you doing? Robin Woodward, I see you too. Randy Hodge Rogers, what's going on? Ivan Brown, what's good with you? Alexis, y'all ain't miss me. Y'all ain't notice I was even going. Don't tell me that. Whatever. Okay. Yvonne Epps. You family? Maybe, uh -huh. maybe. Let's shave a little of this so when we, um, I can put Casey this away. Kendall, I see Shirley Turner from Panama City. What's going on with you? Cynthia Williams, I see you. Sharon Fiedler. How you doing, Yolanda? Pa Zelda. Zelda E. Bentley, hey. Love that name too, Zelda. Tammy Rush. Oh, my Dukes is back. Hey, Shorty Barrera, how you doing? My dudes? Yes. I've been playing since I was a kid. Tracy what Belly, how you doing? You doing this what thing? What you need me to do, honey? Carolyn Marshall, thank you for the 100 stars. It is so appreciated. Sheila Taylor, thank you for the 795 stars. Thank you. Y'all better do it. You back? How you doing, Paz Ortiz? Wash my hands. Gertrude Green, Grandma, how you doing, Grandma? I see you. 
That's cool for now. If I need some more, I'll share some more. All right, and so. past Ortiz, you're making stewed chicken and white rice. One, where the pitch at? Two, where the season's at? Three, FedEx to my address. Gotcha. <laughs> Okay, so what we're gonna do, let's start Let's start this pickle. I think that's important to do. We wanna make sure we have these bad boys already pickling. I'm gonna get like a, uh, normally you put it in a jar or something, but I'll just use a bowl. Hey Linda Pendergast, how you doing? Tracy Belly, thank you for the 50 stars. Hey Sandy Harris. Some of these leaks. I want the, the white part. I like that. Cool. How you doing, Audrey McCray? Jamarcus Ellis. Welcome, welcome. This part I'm throwing away. I rinsed the heck out of these and they still ain't clean. How you doing, Clarissa Thompson? Sheldon Singleton, thank you for the 100 stars. And Wendy Knight, thank you for the 50 stars. Did this thing stop moving on me. Oh, it's starting to move, people. Hold on. How you doing, Danny Martinez? Susil Jeffrey, what's going on? And I got J. Nick Mogul from Miami, okay? Got to go back out to Miami for a little bit. Nicole Lee, I see you. Desiree Mitchell, how you doing? Deborah Levisk, I see you. I got a Sabrina Hibbler in the house too. Okay, okay. Linda Bostic, I remember that name. Got you. Okay, so we got these guys here. Levis cut up. Now we're gonna add the agave sweetener in here. It's a little sweet, a little salty, a little acidic. And we're going to hope that we get a quick pickling out of this. I actually want to smash the dill so we get some of that dill flavor. So it might be a fancy, huh? Okay. Bet you ain't got no dill at your house. <laughs> How you doing, smash Adrian Stewart? I'm going to add a little bit of the... the, the Salt, a little dry mustard, and a little of the crushed red pepper. Just a little bit. Just a little bit, y'all. You don't want to need a lot. I'm going to add the apple cider vinegar, a little bit of more water. I'm actually going to add a teeny bit more uh, apple cider vinegar because I want to pickle this as quick as possible. How Just you doing, Tiffany Evans? And there go my beautiful Ma Dukes right there. That's how she threatened me earlier, right, though? I did not threaten you, little boy. <laughs> just a little. Just a little quick pickle we're going to do on this. Don't let that sit while we uh, do our thing. I don't remember thing. having this for that. Okay, you know, Monica has only his heart brown. Excuse us, okay? What happened? Nobody want his heart. You got all his heart. It's okay. <laughs> Willamine Matthews, thank you for the 50 stars. Now, her name was, has has his heart pretty much like, can't nobody oh, touch okay. this. Like, this all mine. Like, okay. All right, so we're going to make the little green anchovy um, garlic sauce. Garlic sauce. <laughs> it's about to get loud, people. Here go a warning. Boom. Here we go. Here we go. All right, so. What is it? We're going to add the roasted garlic in here. Actually, we're gonna, let's add that. The parsley in here. Sheila Taylor, bacon makes everything better, not butter. Bacon. <laughs> We're going to add the garlic in here. We're going to add about the juice of a, a one lemon in here. Sheila L, how you doing? We're going to add the... Uh, Paste of anchovy, so anchovy paste, and we're gonna add coconut milk in there. Let's go ahead and have it do the darn thing. And I got a quirky green scene 
tell daddy you can't properly pickle something in a few minutes. We know this uh, person? Yeah, we're doing a quick pickle. She called me up to tell me that. And tell Thank me you. that you have mushrooms. You are a whole snitch. <laughs> Hey, Dre and Queen, how you doing? I know it's a little loud, folks, so bear with us one time. Sheila Sampson, how you doing? And Vanjie, was it Boos? Dang it. I know how to Buso. pronounce it, but I, I think it is Buso. Yeah, I know how to pronounce Buso. it like, like Junior Seau, Buseau, I guess. Buseau, is it? Maybe? Vanjie, if I'm pronouncing it wrong, please correct me. Please do. Rosalind oh, Gosha, I got you. you. Just gotta add salt or something. Alright. Georgina Reynolds Brown, how you doing? Yeah, so you might want to put it in this and do it. Because that's not going to work. Yes, yeah, not going to work. She's right. I'm not sure what you're right. And everybody's telling me to remind you to make sure the oven is actually on, not just the timer. <laughs> Y'all. Like the other day. Yes, so, it's uh, on. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Y'all always looking out for me. Rose Thompson, there she go right there, Rose Thompson. Uh, can you remind people what we're cooking today, please? We are making um, sear scallops. Uh, we're doing a, a roasted garlic. I'm sorry. We're doing a, a, a mushroom baked rice. We're doing a roasted garlic anchovy green sauce. And a little oh, quick sure. pickled leeks. Quick pickle. So if Courtney's watching, tell her these are quick pickled leeks. Oh, Courtney's definitely watching. Oh, yeah, Courtney's on. Brandon Sauter, how you doing, young sir? Tammy Rush, how you doing, little lady? Margaret Mack, okay. <laughs> Be careful with all that Mack and Miss Margaret. Be careful with that. Now you can drizzle. Angela Hampton, thank you. <laughs> they, we, we made sure of that. So, so Jeffrey, if you say so, if you say y'all miss me, I gotta take y'all word for it. How you doing, Myra McDaniel? Reginald Givens, how you doing? That was loud. We should have warned y'all. I'll cover y'all ears. I'll cover y'all ears. Hold on. It's like a broke jalopy, don't it? like one of them Hondas with a soda can on the bottom of it. And Pamela Colbert, yes, I saw that um, video from Beirut. I saw that. That joint was crazy. I thought it was a movie at first. That explosion in Beirut. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I thought it was a movie. Plant. Yeah. Nah, I think it was a warehouse, they said. I don't know. They'll figure out what it is eventually. And Denise Ferrer, you still need issue, you had issues with the ordering? All right, Denise Ferrer, hit us up, and we will get back to you as soon as possible. Okay, Denise? I got to watch you sometimes. How you doing, Cassandra Platt? Danny Hoya, how you doing? We might have to give it a quick little... Tasha Rice, thank you for the 100 stars. It's about to get loud again, people, so cover your ears, people. Cover your ears. Uh, hopefully, he warns us before he does it next time, people. No, we're going to actually, what we're going to do is not... Um, Pete Lambert, that's a good question. Maybe it tastes like leek, I don't know. What does leeks taste like? Leek. It's like a. <laughs> That's what I said. It tastes like a leek, it's I like guess. A, it's like a mild <laughs> onion. Like it's onion. in the onion family, leek. So, yeah, I guess you have to just taste it. 
and Kathy Davis, I missed that one, but thank you, though. Okay, so we got that going. Let's go ahead and pat these bad boys dry. Be... Kitchen cooking, how you doing? Yeah. That's a lot of K's, though. We're going to be um, searing these tonight. Huh, Tammy Rush said, Derek, you have to soak them in a bowl and the sand falls out. Okay, good to know. I, I just rinsed them because I cut them, but thank you. But they, they these had mud too, so mm -hmm. uh, I, actually, I actually rinsed them and washed them earlier, but uh, yeah. they have. You always have to clean those really well. So they got that earthy taste like um, beets do? Because beets taste like dirt. Yeah, I don't like beets. I don't care what you do to them. I don't like them. I mean, I, I, I beat powder, so I drink that for the morning I before I work out. Natasha Colburn, thank you for the 50 stars. And Summer Gabriel, my dad loves scallops too. Me, eh, they all right. They're great. Zelda, thank Scallops you for the 100 like stars. Had a baby and I don't want to see that baby. Who said that? Oh. Now, you know I bet live. he is. Greedy. Boys. How you doing, Sherry Barton Wilson? <laughs> this leaf tastes like black licorice. <laughs> Nothing tastes like black licorice. Just thank God. That, you got a special set of taste buds for black licorice. I ain't mad Let's at see. you. You're the old person. Those old people, for some reason, that that was the best candy they ever had. Only they candy like they probably could four have. Four pound, four <clears throat> pound, and things like that. Like, who eats that? That's before the sugar sugar coalition came in to put yeah, sugar in everything. Sugar that's and everything. all. And Vonda Jones, welcome, welcome. And you placed the order tonight. And you a appreciate newbie. You, Psst, don't you. let nobody stop you from achieving greatness, Vonda. Uh -huh. That's what I'm talking about. And greatness all, starts with your taste buds. So go ahead and get that order on, young lady. Get that order on. You. Tracy Durham, how you doing? Durham. Um, what? Oh, that, his name is Dunham. The dude with the puppets and all that. Durham is a city. Yeah, North Carolina. Yeah. But her name reminded me of that dude with all the puppets. Oh, uh, Jeff Dunham. Yeah, yeah, Dunham. yeah, that dude. Now we got green stuff on the cabinets, Jesus. You did all that. <laughs> My wife took the thing off. I was like, well. How you doing, Sarah Parker? Sherry Thornton, I see you. I see you. Sonja Williams Keys. Okay, I got you here. Hello to you too, little lady. Teresa Coward, got you. And Valerie Madden. Man, I ain't played Madden in forever. Now that I think about it, I used to love Madden. Desiree Mitchell. What's that? Got a Julia Sharp out of Pennsylvania. Okay. See, there you go, Sheila Taylor. Bacon. Bacon is the key ingredient to life. And, and tequila. Unless you're, unless you're vegetarian. No, no, no. You just deny yourself life. You're a vegetarian. Oh, wow, wow. Or you can make carrot bacon. You saw Tabitha? Go ahead. Yeah. Make that carrot bacon. Yeah, somebody asked us to make the uh, bacon with our, our maple bacon blend, so we'll do it one day. See? It's a lot simpler. Bacon yeah, is life. Steps. Even hyphenated bacon is life, all right? Bacon is life. How you doing, Barbara from Philly? I see you. Courtney still got... See, Courtney, come taste the food, Courtney. Come taste it. You don't believe it's going to be pickled. Come on down and come taste it real quick. Wendy Knight, thank you for the 50 stars. It's called light pickling. You can pickle it longer. Of course, it's not going to be fully pickled. You know, it's Courtney. It's going to be a light pickling. I still want the freshness. I still want to taste the green. But I wanted to have a light pickling, so... And Vangie, she gonna eat them today. How you doing, Amy Ann? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna tell you a big secret about Native. Anytime we go to Esoteric and have that, their um, mushroom risotto, she kills it. Yeah, but you're not making it. Ha <laughs> ha. She said, yeah, but you're not making it. Rose Thompson, thank you for the 50 stars. See, I gotta make a trip to Baltimore. I keep hearing people talk about the housing market out there, so one day I gotta go look at that. How you doing, Wendy? Now I see you in Baltimore. 
Charlene Harris. She just sound like nah Baltimore, you know, certain parts of Baltimore seem like the housing market is you no know, it's, it's, it's a Some of it is, yes. Some of it is, some of it's not. But you know, some housing market is gonna pick up some not just a rotation. And I'm trying to, you know, Get my feet a little wet, that's all, yeah. Shirley Harris. That's a name right there. That sounds like she got that little candy, the little uh, mints in her purse. That's what she sound like. <laughs> Shirley Harris. Sharon Jackson from New Orleans. Love but love. Yes. <laughs> and if y'all don't know, if you are from New Orleans or the Caribbean, I am already biased in your favor. So you already know, you ain't got nothing but love for me because I'm a, I'm a belly friend and I love New Orleans food and I love Caribbean food. Alright, so we're going to blister these tomatoes next I believe um, while we're waiting on the rice and I don't want to do the scallops to the last minute so we're going to let the scallops be nice and uh, fresh. How you doing Melody Nick now? I'm glad, to be one of, I'm glad I want to be heard, thank you. Helen Mack, okay, my grandma name, Helen. Okay, so let's do a quick. Um, Helen Mack, that tropical storm that came through, I don't know, was it ISIS or whatever it was, it was I. It it hit us. Rain while wasn't that bad. It was the wind that did the most damage. Plenty of trees down, thousands without power. So yeah, but rain the flooding wasn't really bad at all. It was just the wind. It was really really bad. I think I'm just going to use in this, I'm going to keep it simple again. We're going to use our pink Himalayan sea salt. Oh, I got use. a question though. Okay, go ahead. Linda Pendergrass asked Derek, you yeah. said you would try making some sort of crab stuffed tomatoes. Where is it? I haven't seen it yet. Mm, good question. I, have have crab meat. I do have crab meat that I'm going to use in this. Now that I think about it. Thank you for reminding me of that bit. <laughs> but yeah, no, I have not. Uh, I'll probably have to try to do that one day. Okay, um, you know what? Let's do a little bit of garlic with this too. I feel like a little garlic. Did Grandma Green save the pizza or something? Because I got an Angela Hampton saying, Grandma Green, Mama Green to the rescue again, saving the sauce like she helped make sure the pizza was down and brown. <laughs> What's that about? <laughs> wow. He still ain't let me live with the pizza. Huh? Oh, okay. so, so something happened with the pizza? Though. Yeah, you missed it there, homie. Um, Did that make sleep on the pizza? <laughs> It's good, Daryl, but I had to recook. I had to recook it. Okay, I will tell you. I will give it that. I had to recook it. What happened was somebody turned the uh, oven off. When they you were. did. <laughs> hey, why you want to throw out names? Like and white. Thank you for the fifty stars. Somebody threw out. Somebody uh, cut the onion, oven off, and my pizza. Nita's uh, miraculously, uh, the oven was on for. No, it was not. <laughs> <laughs> Who asking her over there? Why are you lying? Who asking her over there? That's my question. Liz Jones, you love pickle beets? Ew, what's wrong with your tongue? Oh, I like pickle beets. Your tongue right, is broke. A little, a little bit. Antonio Powell, thank you for the 50 stars. How about oil here? And White, thank you for another 50 stars. I'll throw the garlic in there. And Rosalind Gosha, they doing good, Miss Lady. They doing good. <laughs> Deborah Lavis, if you don't mind. If you don't mind. Just... And Tammy Montgomery, I let him tell you. Well, tell the people what's in the blender. They see this incredible hog mix over what's here. What's in the blender? In the blender <laughs> is our uh, roasted garlic anchovy uh, green sauce. That we're gonna uh, have with this, it pretty much is um, about a half, about a half a head of garlic roasted um, cloves, um, and then we actually took a little parsley, a little olive oil, a little lemon juice. You know, I even typed out the recipe already. It's on the website, but boom, right there, there. Boom, look at that. Right so there. There you go, people. There you go. I put it right there. I typed out the recipe so Roasted I can, garlic I can put and it on anchovy, the anchovy green sauce right there. Boom. It's actually on the website now because I typed it up beforehand. Cause I get tired of being tired after the live and have to type up three or four recipes. And then also answer phone calls and emails. So I'm just like, you know what? 
Let me go ahead and do that ahead of time. Let me do that. And Pash Douglas, thank you for the 100 stars. All right, so we got <clears> a little <throat> bit of um, fragrant coming from the um, the garlic. So we're going to go ahead and throw these bad boys on here just a little bit. And we're just trying to blister them a little bit. I'm going to add a bit of our, our cooking greens, no salt, onion, black pepper. Just a little bit. Just a little. And we're going to add a teeny bit of salt. Salt from where? From cooking with range, of course. I didn't see that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got you, boy. I got you, boy. Boom! Okay, okay. I'll pick him on any sea salt. And I'm going to hit it with a little bit. And that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to get a little blistery. And I'm going to get a little bit of 100% maple syrup. Just a little bit to help bring out that sweetness. You want to get a little bit of blistering on here. You want to keep them whole. I'm going to use them for plating up uh, at the end. Turn it down a little bit. Don't move it too much. How are you now doing, the lean carpenter? Petey Lambert, how you doing? All right, let's check out on our rice. And then we're going to actually um, take this bad boy. And Linda Pendergrass, I didn't send it yet. Yours was the five pack in the apron. Didn't forget about it. It's gonna, you're gonna get to it. Trust me, you're gonna get it. I said it. I'm a man of my word, and I said you're gonna get it. All right, so let's take this off and, and leave it in there about 20 more minutes. I think should be fine. Gonna be a lot of butter on the top. Don't worry, that's gonna soak in. It's gonna make it delectable. Trust me on this one. Trust me on this one. Let's put it back in there. Give it about, what did I say, 20, 25 minutes maybe? I'll give it about 25. Now let's see if I can do this without turning off the uh, cancel bake. Okay, boom, timer. And Peggy says, my family, we use a lot of the seafood and ranch and some of the barbecue. The barbecue is amazing on ribs and chicken. Yes, okay, Peggy. Let them know, Peggy. Let them know. Get a little pop pop from these bad boys. Pash Douglas, green seasonings will change your life. See, that's what I'm talking yes, about. I appreciate that. That's Deborah that Lavis, I wrap my boneless chicken breast in bacon. That's what I'm talking about. Like, Woo. You, like, you, sound, you know what you're doing. And when I make meatloaf, I wrap it. Like and you know she wrapped her meatloaf in bacon. She took it literal. Like bacon, bacon is, is life. life. Yes. She took it seriously. I like pickling already, Courtney. And white, thank you for another 50 stars, and white. Sharon Jackson, New Orleans. Trinice Weber, New Orleans, I see you. Want to get it right to where the skin starts um, kind of releasing. And then we're going to serve these bad boys warm over the, uh, over that, uh, those scallops or in in that uh, rice, big rice on top of the rice, big rice. And Jasla Genzel, they are actually in my truck right now, actually. What's your truck? The lights, the, the LED lights I bought. Oh, oh, you bought LED lights for us? Yeah. All of the lights, all of the lights. Fancy, boy. You fancy, Dad. Uh, Linda Pendergrass says some Hennessy and brown sugar is a staple. Yummy. Hennessy and brown, brown sugar. sugar. Okay. I ain't gonna let her cook for the church dinner. <laughs> she can't cook for the church dinner. They ain't gonna have the saints messed up. Well, I'm thinking you come to church for real. Yeah, the saints were talking about when they fell out. In the church. Shirley that Green. No Baton Rouge, I see you. And when I got you, and when I, I like shot you are. out. I kind of like where they are. Okay. I kind of like what they are. Just a little blistered uh, tomatoes. 
go ahead. I probably should have did him in small because I think I need a larger one for the scale. Mm -hmm. So, how you doing, Marcia Hawkins? Let's do this. Tafera Jones, Syracuse, New York. Okay. Carolyn Pena, South Carolina. Up oh, and I got a question. Uh -huh. Kelly Yolanda Davis is asking, how can you check your order status? Um, if you order, if you got an email. So if you ordered in the last two weeks, um, we made an announcement. We also sent out emails. You might not have gotten it. It might have gone to your junk mail. Um, our, our supplier for our, our bottles was back ordered and they didn't tell us. So we, we were waiting for a delivery and we didn't get it. We gave them a call and said, what's going on? So they were like, oh yeah, it's going to be, it's going to take another two weeks to get it. So, um, they threw in a little extra bottles for us, but we're getting our bottles on Friday and we'll be mailing them out Monday and usually get them in two days after that. So you will get an email. So if you want a status, just to make sure we got your order, because someone actually called us today about that, just hit us up afterwards and I'll look you up. All right. Super simple. So boom, there we go. Act like that was in a hot pan right there. Act like that was in a hot Bam. pan. There we go. Some blistered tomatoes. Andy super, Blackman, super Trinidad, I see you. Trinidad, what's up, man? Yeah, I'm definitely going to go to Trinidad. That's on my list. All right. In Unity, I haven't seen your picture, but I'll go look. I saw it. You did? You seen hers? Okay. Antoinette Gaddy, like your little emoji person. I got a Melinda Sims. No pizza today, Mr. Green, if no, you don't mind. <laughs> not, not if you mind. No, I'll, no, no pizza. Y'all never going to let me listen. No, pizza. I now see I that. Like the pizza is a thing, Daryl. I you, see. You notice that the pizza is a thing. I don't know if you know yet. But I must have missed it. I was doing my little training on baby thing, pips, so I missed it. Thing. All right, so you got these guys um, padded dry. You want to keep them as dry as possible. You want to allow them to get to room temperature. And they'll just they'll caramelize a little better. That's all that does. You can you don't have to do it this way. This is the way I found that it works better. Okay. So um, if you have never had sea scallops, they're pretty simple. If you have baked scallops, they're totally different. Um, the sea scallops are a lot sweeter, a little more meaty texture. Um, it takes a lot less to cook. Pretty much the the way that most people cook these is you sear them. You put them in a hot pan, set them down. Do not touch them. Allow them to crystal, um, the sugars to kind of caramelize on the bottom. Flip them over, they're done. You can add a little salt at the end or during the cooking, not before because it releases too much liquid and you get rubbery, okay? Never overcook these either. Doesn't take but a few minutes, so. Gotta put this in a hot skillet. So what we do is just sit them down like this. From Laser Harley Bush, how you doing? Hey, Barbara Peters. Kind of to set them too, too close because then you get steamed scallops and you don't want that either. And Carlene Marshall, yes. That is the only reason why I go to New Orleans is because of the food. That was, I'm not gonna lie to you. Business took me there and my stomach stayed forever. I can really smell that, okay. Barbara Peters, I'll buy no pizza, really. Yeah, they were calling my pizza all kinds of names, y'all. I, I needed your help so bad. You should have came in and helped me because your mom wasn't helping. And Shirley Harris said, you turned the oven off on my mother's perfect pizza because you was jealous. <laughs> well, so that's the story, y'all. Right? She got me choking over here. Right? Okay, all right. Okay, all right, all Yo. Right, all right. Okay, all right. <laughs> Julia Sharp, he said raw pizza was good. <laughs> it, was, look, it was delicious, y'all. I don't mean, I don't mean no harm. Y'all, y'all, you had Yo, some? that was no, funny. Have, nah, I warmed it up. It wasn't bad if I heated it up. See, Kathy Davis, okay. I go to this one shop and get the beets in powder form. They don't put anything in the beets. It's just pure powdered beets. Then what I do with that is I put it in a water bottle. And I take a little bit of um, Mio, the caffeine Mio, shoot a little bit in there and shake it up and drink it like a pro, pro drink before I work out. Because supposedly beets help with blood circulation, so 
So think about it. When you're working out, you want better blood circulation, better breathing. So boom. And actually, I feel a lot better afterwards too. Good. <coughs> okay. I got. Excuse me. I got a Tammy Rush asking. Have you ever used grapeseed oil? Yeah. You mean this stuff right here? Damn. Uh huh. We sure do. Go for you. Got a high um, heat uh, rating. Got a little brown that come in it. Mm -hmm. You're gonna give it. You give only like a couple of minutes though. That middle one really brown. The dryer, the um, I put like a little too much oil in there. The dryer is better too. Um, but you want to put a little bit so it doesn't stick. In unity, I'm glad you're being a good girl. I appreciate that. Yo, y'all are not gonna leave this pizza thing alone. I gotta have to go back and watch that. <laughs> Casey Kendall, how you doing? Let me give a second. And Cena Ladybug making creamy chicken with white rice. But mm. Cena, you already know what I'm gonna ask you, right, miss? Cena's the animal. She knows she can keep it. Seasonings in the picture, miss. Let us know, let us know. Antonio Powell, how you doing today, sir? Got Lily Crenshaw in the house. These okay. are big, so they're taking a little more longer than uh, normal. Denise Williams, thank you for the 100 stars. We so appreciate it. Definitely. I got a Rachel Williams. How you doing today? Okay, it's Lavique. So Deborah Lavique. Okay, I got you. Lavique. I'm gonna try to remember that. I thought it was Levesque. Yeah, I did too. But Deborah Lavique, I got you. If you like Caesar dressing with, you like anchovies? They taste the same, really? Yeah, anchovies are what Caesar, Caesar uh, salad dressing. Really? Yeah. That taste from, yeah. Had no idea. <coughs> Cause I'm not really a fan of anchovies, but I do Caesar once in a while. Like, I don't like um, avocado like that, but I love some sushi though, so. Wow, Angela Hampton with another one. She said, you know his pizza was bad looking when your mom just took her hand and waved it and walked away. <laughs> like, dang. <laughs> I see how it is. I see how it is. All right, we're going to set these probably aside for a second. They are going to release some water. Um, mm -hmm. Unfortunately, I'm going to put them on the hidden because of that. I'm going to make it a little early to so try to get everything done. And Nicole Lee said, I'll be the taste tester if you don't mind. I don't. I don't <laughs> mind. If you don't mind. How you doing, Lisa Knowles? Any relation to um, a Miss Beyonce Knowles? Uh -huh. Dag, Julia Sharp said, poor Anita was laughing so hard, couldn't catch her breath. She really Mama was. Green was laughing too. They, was all, they were all were not my friend last night. <laughs> they were all, was that last night? No, that wasn't last night. But they weren't my friends, let's put it like that. None of them was my friend. <laughs> not a one of them. And Joyce A. Cox said, your spice blends are heaven sent. Thank you, I Joyce. love them all. Thank you so much. We appreciate you for even trying them means a lot because we know y'all got a lot of options we know y'all go to the dollar store and the grocery store and other people are, are um you know selling their products online so we appreciate that you try ours and then come back for more that means a lot it means a whole heck of a lot you know? a little less how you doing shanda claxton i missed y'all too just a little bit though don't tell nobody Ain't i got the reputation nobody. to maintain Kanisha Cash, New Orleans, I see you. Didn't I have one? Sharvella Harrington. Oh, I got them all okay. on there. I thought I had some more. Oh, Lord. What? I thought I had some more um, scallops. I don't. I just did that for nothing. <laughs> did that for 
Ain't gonna hurt nobody. Ain't gonna hurt nobody. And Donna Turner, I'll get to your question in three, two, one. Let the people know what we have in the game. Let what, the people what, know. What we have in the game? Yes. We have it. The people, the people are really coming in late, huh? Yeah. We have in uh, seared scallops uh, over a mushroom baked rice. Um, and then we're gonna do a green sauce, a green anchovy roasted garlic sauce. And did I miss anything? And some blistered um, tomatoes. Real simple, so easy, even a boy can do it. I'm hoping that um, this is about 10 more minutes, so I actually really made it. Donna really Shepherd trying to put her whole to family to sleep. She yeah, said food. she made pork chops, fried mm -hmm. apples, and cabbage. Pork Ooh, chops? Fried apples fried and, apple and cabbage. cabbage. That do oh, sound good. And, and she said, I have to order some more of your seasonings. Oh, and next time I post a picture, see Donna, thank you. You are, see Donna, I've been saying your name too many times, but you already understand that. You be listening, woman. You be listening. See, and I can't wait to see your food. Now I got to see that. And Julia Sharp, there you go. She wrap a hot dog with bacon and then bake it and add cheese to it. Okay. Everybody baking it, huh? I see it. Bacon's life. The Bacon Coalition. Obviously. And Liz Jones is having pinto beans, buttermilk, cornbread, sweet potatoes, and baked chicken. Okay. Okay, Liz, I see you. But you already know. Where the picture? <laughs> what seasons did you use? Come on, come on, Liz. You know the routine. You've been here long enough to know the routine. And Margaret Smith, yeah, we kind of got backed up with that though by our supplier, but as soon as we get them in, they'll be out immediately. But send us, hit us in a message, and we'll check your order status. Yeah, we sent last week an uh, email out to everyone, um, pretty much letting you know what was going on as soon as we found out about it, because we were trying to figure out what was happening too. And then gave you the option of either waiting or you could get your money back, and we uh, kind of understand that. Some people are like, I think we had one person who was like, I don't want my money back, but I am moving at the end of the month, and I need to give you a new address. So other than that, it's been pretty cool. So, cool. Right. So, oh, 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 I want to see if um, how we doing on our. And Alexis Baldwin said, "Do they have meatloaf?" Mashed potatoes and Aunt Nita's gravy for dinner. See, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. Y'all taste buds are in full effect. Goodness, yeah, this almost done. Okay, you're doing Donna Strobel. We're gonna get about five more minutes and we're gonna start making the uh, plates there. Okay. We gonna stop making the plates. And Trina Meadows, you don't need to see the camera, man. It's just a voice, that's uh -huh. all. It's just it's a voice. The voice. Let's see, how are we going to plate these? We're going to plate these. <laughs> really, Sharon Fiedler? My friend with the accents. I'm having crab legs, potato and cucumbers, corn on the cob, in the microwave, and tomato cucumber salad. Oh, y'all okay. like that in the microwave. Okay. Uh -huh. She added that part. They okay, like that Sharon. In the, in the microwave I like that, too. But, Sharon, you already know the routine, Sharon. I've seen Not your name a few times. Uh, let's see. Things are gonna get and Emmy Karam from St. Martin. That's what I'm talking about. And <laughs> Unity's cheating today. It's having Domino's Chicken Alfredo instead. Domino's but, Chicken Alfredo. That's but right. using the go-to seasonings on top of it. <laughs> See, there you go. That's all that matters. There that's you go, Unity. You know. Matters. And Johnetta Harper is asking, Mr. Derek, when is your next pop-up shop? Uh, I don't know. Uh, we were invited to one next week, but I don't think we're going to be going. Um, we'll let you know as soon as we have one. We will be starting to do more pop-ups, especially in the Virginia Beach area. We can't really travel outside the state mm -hmm. because, you know, we, we, we've been in a bad state here. Our state's been bad. <laughs> we've been acting up. And they put us on punishment. Let me just put this right here, so I have the rum here. Ooh, child, things are gonna get easier. In Unity Menace, however, that gene missed me, but I got the eating gene, though. I got that one. Ooh, 
How you doing, Beverly Jones? Come look at this here. Come look I'm at this. I'm coming. I'm coming. Can somebody come look at this here? Can somebody come look at this? Give it a second. It's going cool to seep down seat. in there. Yeah. It's going to seep down in there, the butter and stuff. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yo, Angela Hampton is not letting up on that pizza. <laughs> never. They don't never let me live, Daryl. They don't let me live. Might as well make a t shirt out of it now. <laughs> oh, let's get some of this uh, Parmesan on top. Just a little bit. Ooh, child. Okay, yeah, it's a fat boy. I know. Stop judging. It's a fat yeah. boy me meal. Or side dish. You could actually have this as a dish. I ain't gonna lie. You got Gloria vegetables. Morgan, I got you. Reach out to us, and my dad will put you through all of that and give you all the information you need for that. Gloria Morgan wants to get the 17 pack. Excellent. So Love he'll give it. you Love all the information. Love to hear it. Are we gonna let that sit for a second before I played it? It feels in my spirit like it needs to sit for a second. So I'm gonna let it sit. What you say, spirit? <laughs> Yo, <laughs> them yes. and this pizza, they is killing they it. Live. Yes, they, they, don't let, they don't let a brother live. I'll try not to cry because they had me their laughing problem, so hard. This is what their problem there is. They don't let their brother live. Yo, y'all are they too funny. Hey, Jamika Lynch, or can I just call you Mika? Well, I don't know you like that yet, so I'm gonna call you Jamika Lynch until further notice. And Tracy Durham, thank you for the 100 stars. Tracy, yes, they are. They, he might as well make a shirt out of the pizza. He might as well make a shirt out of it for the pizza thing. Mm -hmm. He might as well capitalize on it. Nope. Put a, even a boy can do it over a messed up pizza background. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my mom even said, I guess a boy can do it. See, there you go. <laughs> See? Wow, mom. <laughs> Really, mom. Really you might mom. as well put that up there. Really, mom? That's how you gonna feel? Ooh, y'all come look at this, boy. And Julia Sharp, I'm gonna definitely watch it, Julia. Ooh. It was going on the cold, Lee. Yeah. Barbara Rivers, how you doing? I ain't seen your name in a little bit. Okay. Hold on. Where is um Delasia? I didn't see Delasia pop up. Another one of my favorite names. I got my granny bacon. I got my auntie Zelda. I got a little unity. <laughs> a little unity. Huh? Mm hmm. Hey, Melody Sharon. But I ain't see my Delasia Banks. I ain't see that name. Brittany Billy, how you doing? And Joyce A. Cox, give me a high five through, through the phone. Just give me a high five. So, but I will keep buying your spice blends as long as you are selling them. Thank you. Ooh, her taste buds is in full effect. That's what Thank I'm talking you about. That's what I like to hear. How you doing, Wanda Walker? Mm -mm. Daryl, do you ooh, do you even smell this, Daryl? I can smell it actually. Oh, dang. This whole thing wanna I wanna marry this whole plate. And Brenda Artsis, we are working on that pop up. We're working on it. We got a nice creamy. And <laughs> never these shirts, we must be from the south. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've been all over. Mm -hmm. Rita is actually from the south, south. So let me get. And Carolyn Marshall, if you have any further issues trying to order, just hit us up. Yep. And we will literally walk Please you through do. the process or do it right there over the phone for you. We are definitely a customer friendly business. Yeah. Brittany Belly, I knew you was friends for a reason. Bacon is life. That's what I'm talking about. Tammy Rush had KFC. Actually, that was one of my first fast food jobs actually working at KFC. Me and Jamal used to work there. And we had so much fun <laughs> creating all kinds of meals in the back. Whoa, 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 Jamaica Lynch. I made a double baked and stuffed pumpkin pie with the mixed berry lemon topping. Mm, that that sounds good. good. Jamaica Lynch, I don't recognize your name though, but well, where is the picture, right. young lady? Where is the picture? I want to see that. That just sounds good. 
Joyce A. Cox, she wants so much love today. She uh-huh. talked about bacon is my life, along with your maple bacon blend. Mm. Oof, oof. She is preaching today, okay? Preaching to the choir, though. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Old Neil Jefferson, I see you. Helen Mack made stuffed pork and Brussels sprouts and baked potatoes. Okay, okay, I like that. <laughs> Julia Robinson, I saw you earlier, Miss Miss UK. I see you over there. Monica Fraz, thank you for the 50 stars. You go to Master Platician here. I'm so mad I had to make those. those and Linda Pendergrass, you can't be like showing your number for everybody to see. You don't want no stalkers. And Melody Sharon, you are a big tease. Talk about I was in St. Martin and then St. Thomas in March. Psh, really? Really? <sighs> Horrible. You on time out. You on time out, Melody. Oh, you were in North Carolina Unity? Okay, I ain't been out there in a minute. Y'all know y'all can have some more uh, rice and all the other stuff. I'm just trying to make pretty plates right now. <laughs> yeah, because my, um, my brother live out that way in North Carolina. Well, soup. used to anyway. How you doing, Susan Adrian? Let's get... And Shirley Turner, good night. See, and Shirley Turner got right on the first try from wow. Amen. Hold on. Well, she made her own of my bad. I apologize. She said, Good night. Have a great evening. From my kitchen to yours and to and my home to yours. <laughs> so she made, made, made her own of I gotta go trade mine real quick. Let me go trademark mine real quick. Somebody steal that. Shernet Ford from Jersey. How you doing? Oh, Susan Adrian, I think I might have missed that. She said, "Don't forget to activate your tongs." Oh. That was—I must have missed hers earlier. Sorry, I might have—I might have forgot it, y'all. I'm not gonna say I did. And Cynthia Nicholson, it does look delicious, doesn't it? Okay, I hear you, uh, oven. I know you're done. And she said, "Turn that oven off," and then just start beeping too. And Linda Pendergrass, she says it has a farmer's market out that way. And Gloucester, yeah, I okay. Talk to me about that. Yeah, Gloucester County, okay. Nicole, you saw that too, Nicole? Everybody saw the pizza. I gotta watch the pizza thing, apparently. I'm you now. Hey, Kim Bino, how you doing? Okay, I know. <laughs> And Carrie Ryan, is it off? Yeah, it's off. Carrie. It's off. That's just the timer. Yeah. Pretty much saying, hey, 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 <coughs> done. Hey, hey, hey. So I, I ain't listening to it, obviously. And Jeremiah Coward, how you? That's your name for real? All right, Jeremiah. He's scared. That <laughs> just caught me off guard. He's scared. Now you read something. I'm not sure if you read it right. So you think about it? Not at all. Yo, they is not gonna ever let go of this pizza one. They is on it. Never, 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 never. How about never? Nakia Jones, please watch the replay. Go ahead. We ain't gonna stop you. That's a bad circle. That's one just got some obvious face. That's him just gonna go away with it. Everybody saying that mom's pizza was way better, apparently. Obviously. That's how I let her win. Let me let this one do the same thing. That's, that's that. Sir Dave Foster, no, the bottles aren't in yet. We already talked with the supplier. They had a little snafu, but didn't tell us about it. 
So we will get yeah. them in as soon as we get them we in. Friday. Got you. Friday is supposed to be the day that we have them. So as soon as we get them, y'all. Ursula get them. Sterling, how are you? I've only met one person ever named okay. Ursula. You stop. You stop. I forgot to stop. 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 Okay. Everybody stop. Sierra Lynn, how you doing? Cedra Foster, yes. Yes to you. Whatever you want me to say yes to, yes. How you doing, Rita McBride Thomas? Okay. Joyce Ann Goodno, how are you? And Lulu Smith Parker from Birmingham, Alabama, please feel free to buy more seasonings. We will not stop you. Not at all. And Jamaica Lynch, send us the recipe. Please send us the recipe. I'm curious. I want to see that. The one where she ate the double pumpkin pie with the blue oh. lemon, the um, blueberry yeah, lemon sauce. I want to see that. Y'all see how simple that is? Y'all show them. And show Joyce Fote, that's, that's what he does. Show them what they're working with. He's doing master class show, show, show on plate. That's just what he does. Now I'm still learning. The, 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 the king is, is Chef Wofford. I'm going to wait for Chef James Wofford to show me some more stuff. He's going to show me some more stuff. <laughs> and no people, he is not doing a restaurant. I might talk him into a food truck maybe, but not a restaurant. Do y'all see that? It's so simple, so easy, gonna be delicious, Daryl. I want you to taste it. Hey Ma, you wanna taste first? I don't wanna be first. You wanna be take pictures. Okay, her do the pictures first and then she could be I'm first. Take some pictures. Cause I ain't even I'm hungry right now first. to be honest with you. Oh, Y'all need to move anything out of the way? Okay, I got that I got my rice. I'm gonna put my rice over here. Gotta put away some of my dishes that I've been washing. And Cedra Foster, we got you, Cedra Foster, we, we are, got we are, you. We are, uh, my phone is over there by the TV. I mean, it kind of is, but. Uh, yeah, it is, but. <laughs> it's, so why am I wasting my time? You don't waste your time. You're not. I'm gonna, I'm gonna this gonna part is good. Oh, now just hit this. Hit back. And hit that. Dumb pictures uh, so I can taste my food. Uh, oh, it's dumb pictures all of a sudden. Mm -hmm. There you go. Boom. Super simple. Picture in a picture, baby. <laughs> picture in a picture. <laughs> she said, she said, since y'all since y'all so great. Let me move y'all since your phones are so great. And Sir Dave Foster, I should, you from P-Town? Okay. Let's taste. Jamaica Lynch, thank you. He asked me, watch, said you redeemed yourself from the pizza. <laughs> okay, she said, Grace, I didn't have to, I didn't have to, uh... And Patricia Harris, thank you for the 50 stars. I'm sure they're dancing for the food. You know it's good if you're dancing. And Joyce food was that Fute, I believe. She's that? chilling right now, Joyce. Mm, no, she's sleep. Oh, she's sleep now. Okay. I'm bringing sleep. Just kind of mix some of it together there and try. Yeah. With this guy. With Sean Knox, it, how you doing? I think it was just gonna be me and you. You gonna do it like that? Okay. <laughs> Vanessa, Vanessa Dixon, say how are y'all doing that? today? If you don't mind, another one. She said she'll come pick up her plate in a little bit. Okay, Vanessa, come on. This is really good. Boom, y'all. Super simple. Even the boy did it. Real easy. The recipe is on the website. Yeah, I made the recipe already. I was thinking ahead. I, I even copied it and printed it out because I've never done this before. It was my first. You see, I was going to just use green onions, but I went and bought leeks. You can also use green onions if you want. Maybe I'll rename that to pickled leeks slash green onions. Um, the roasted garlic and anchovy green sauce that we made. Um, you see, when I, I, I forgot to even add parsley, so I added the parsley when I typed it out. Um, and the mushroom baked rice. Super, super simple. If you actually, you could actually probably do this recipe with instant rice, but I don't, if you don't, if you, if, if you, you don't, don't if you don't mind, mm -hmm. if, you, if you do mind, <coughs> if you do mind, take the cream of mushroom soup, the beef broth, bring it to a boil, add the cup of um, rice, turn the heat off, and just cover it. 
and let it do this thing, okay? So that's a little quick way to do the same recipe. And Kimberly Rose, thank you for the 50 stars. All right, so we're going to eat um, and clean up. But we thank you guys for being here. Thank you. Um, hold on, let me, let me show them. Let me show you show them the deal here. It was so easy, even a boy could do it. You see that? That's yes. what that was. And then we got how many? Um, did we get any more? stars today? We got two thousand two hundred and ninety-five stars. Twenty-two bucks. That's awesome. Every twenty-five dollars um, helps the family. So thank you guys for that. Um, we gave two hundred forty-nine gifts of groceries to date. Um, we're gonna give some more. And thanks to our patrons, we have about sixteen that we can do. So thank you guys. It's been the beginning of the month, so the money hit our account. So we are going to be giving more gifts of groceries out. Ask them to change that. Plus the one we did tonight. So. And Tawan Tamer, yes, we do have seasons. We have a whole line of 17 Tuan, Tuan seasons. Season. There are healthy there you go, Tuan alternative Tamer. vegan seasoning blends. So, um, and it's actually, pinned at the bottom of the screen. Yes. Where you can look at pinned. the bottom below. Damn. Super simple. I think all the, actually these two right here too. That I use today. Hey, Boom. Go. We have no salt blends, some with pink Himalayan, some not, but the crown jewel, the oh, creme de la this, creme. Everybody has the their own crown jewel. This is his creme. crown jewel. Right here. He thinks this is the best dun, one. Dun, dun, dun. Some people think Creole is the best Maple one. Maple bacon. Some bread. people think the nacho cheese. Some people like the lemon red bell pepper. Some people like the butter. And that ranch. I like that ranch, Get too. Get one and, and make it your, your favorite. So which one are you taking? Because I'm about to eat the other one. Don't matter to me. I'm 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 about to probably take whatever you want. All right, let's get in. Let's get some of this in my in my face hole so we can taste it. We gonna taste this. Let me say my grace real quick. Happy Father's Day for this food. Mm -hmm. We ask you to bless right now for the nourishment of my Jesus. Okay. First of all, let's get this lightly pickled. So, how do people join the the Cooking with Greens family page on Facebook? You just go and look for Cooking with Greens. Okay. And join, like, and join. And follow. Let's try this. And darling K. Johnson, no, my dad is not a chef by trade. He is self taught. Mmm, that's good. Mm -hmm. He's a self taught chef. He's the kind of chef that he can look in the refrigerator and turn something into something. Mm -hmm. Ain't got to go together, but somehow he'll put it together. That's good right there, y'all. Y'all, you need to get this. Mm -hmm. I ain't really hungry right now, to be honest with you. Be honest with you, I'm about to eat your plate. So you love scallops. Keep messing way. around. Hmm. Good, good. Mm hmm. And Pash Douglas, I would definitely go back and watch the pizza video. <laughs> <coughs> I'm sorry. Where's the crab meat in this? No, I meant to put crab meat. I didn't. I meant to sprinkle it with crab meat. Leon Gibbs said it looks like a hundred dollar plate. Okay, oh Mr. God, Leon, so I see. Mm, so good. And Joyce, a cheesesteak does sound good. Where cheesesteak and cheesesteak sound good right about now, Joyce. Mm -hmm. Oh, good question. Well, no, it's not cold, Linda. But Linda, Linda Parker asked. She just came in and says that to be eaten cold. Could you eat it cold? You could if you want to. If you're anything like, remember Chris? He used to like everything cold. Mm -hmm. had. had to cool down before you ate it. It's better hot, but you can eat it cold. Andrea Paint, um, Andrea Paint. The weather's actually decent right now. It was like ninety some early, like ninety one earlier, but I was cloudy and chill right now. Mm -hmm. Really good. The sweetness of these um, scallops are perfect. The light sweetness and tartness of the, um, the cherry tomatoes, and then that creamy, creamy, buttery. Oh my God! Did I say creamy? Mm -hmm. Buttery, creamy rice. Uh, and then you got a little citrus coming through here. The anchovy is really nice on the bottom of that. Mm -hmm. Ruth Johnson, that sounds good though, but don't be putting your number out here for everybody to see. Mm -hmm. You don't want no stalker sounding that good with so your good, food? That food sounded good too. Liz Jones, good night, Liz Jones. Sweet dreams. A little bit of that vinegar 
kind of cuts through the fat too. A little bit of that. And Rose Thompson, I understand where you're coming from, though, but the logistics on that alone is a lot of work. I'm talking about make this food like this and put it in the freezer section for people to buy it. I uh, mean, that sounds good, but the logistics hard, yeah. alone is crazy. To be able to make it affordable mm -hmm. and, um, and it, to ensure the quality is the same, I'm going to be able to do that. And the amount of money it will take. Mm -hmm. I'm not at that level yet. Hey, Joseph. One day, Hunter. maybe. One day. You never know. I might have my own food line. You never know. D. Motley, thank you for the 100 stars. Mm, this look good. And Patricia Harris, thank you for another 100 stars. Omar Woods, what's going on with you? You like this version? And Wendy Blackman, no, that was not rice, Wendy Blackman. Mm -hmm. You did put rice in the back of that? Oh, right. I didn't even see that. Wow, yep. I'm it's sorry, I'm sorry, Wendy. Yeah, some mushroom. I missed that. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, creamy mushroom uh, and butter so and butter uh, baked rice. You know I'm not that close to the plate, people. I just zoomed in. That's why mm -hmm. I just zoomed in. This thing gone already. How you doing, Marlene Marshall from Tuscaloosa, Alabama? Mm -hmm. And Patricia Davis, yes, definitely go order your spices. Mm -hmm. Ramona Shockley, look look at this man right here. He done killed the plate. He done killed the plate. Look no, at this. I'm very angry. But he loves scallops anyway, so he oh killed that. Yeah. That was so good. He I'm inhaled angry. it. Oh my god. That was so good that I'm angry. He engulfed it, then inhaled it. It was, was gone. That was so good that I'm angry. Now I gotta have a hot, a hot glass of wine. <laughs> I, I didn't think I had to put nothing in the fridge. Joyce food. Joyce food. I hope I said your last name right. Food right? F O O T E, or is it just foot? Foot. Joyce foot. That'll work too. Have a good night, sweetheart. My apologies if I messed your name up. Man, y'all. That was so good. Nicole Lee, you can't have my plate. So nope, decadent. sorry. And Darlene K. Johnson, he does a great job. He definitely right. does. So Making me angry. Omar Woods, yeah, I was talking about cheesesteak from Philly. Only thing I don't like about it is the cheese whiz, though. I, I still can't get down with that cheese whiz cheesesteak, though. I mean, if you're from Philly, my bad. I'm sorry, I just can't do it. I tried it. It just don't work for my taste buds. Yeah, then how's that, uh, the mushrooms? I don't like them. <laughs> Ooh, y'all. Mm -mm. Julia Robinson, good night, Julia Robinson, all the way in the UK. So good. Thank you, Julia, for being here again. Mm -hmm. Y'all don't even understand how good it is. Mm. Mary Down, <laughs> Mary mm -hmm. Downson says she's hungry now. Gotta go eat. Gotta go eat. Watching us not eating is bad yeah, for you your health. Yeah, you always need that. The little bit of um, pickle from that, the little um, sweetness from the tomato, and that sauce definitely mm -hmm. because it, it it cuts through the heaviness of this right here. But it's good if you like that heavy kind of stuff. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> Gwendolyn Johnson. This so is dinner. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yup. Mm-hmm. I eat that piece for y'all. Mm-hmm. This one's for the last person right here. Mm. Up oh, and Wendy Blackman asked, what rice did you use? I used the long grain um ja uh basmati rice. You can use whatever rice you like, but I suggest the long grain jasmine or basmati. No um, no instant rice. If you do it with instant rice, if that's all you have. Um, follow the directions. Take all the ingredients. I would actually saute the vegetables first uh, aside. Um, I would boil the broth and the um, and the um, what can I think right now? The broth and the uh, what's the other liquid I had in there? And then and a cream of mushroom soup. I would boil that and then I'd add the instant rice to the pot and turn it off. And then when you finish, fluff all the rest of the ingredients in there. Okay, mm -hmm. so it shouldn't take long because what's five, six, seven minutes for instant rice? So that's actually a way faster way to do it. Cut some of the butter, cut down on a little, a little bit of the butter too. But I would add the butter. You know what? Now that I think about it, I would put the butter and the broth and the cream of mushroom soup in there, let it come to a boil. Um, do the vegetables on the side, saute them. You can throw them in there then if you like, and then add the cup of uh, instant rice in there and just cover it. 
and let it sit off heat, off the heat, okay? For about five, 10 minutes. It shouldn't take more than seven minutes or so. And you can get almost the same thing. You got any more questions? No, I'm reading through some of these. And yeah, share the food. LC. Only ones I had in Philly had that cheese was on it, and I don't like that. I like pepper jack, if anything, with mine. Now, I feel real bad that you sit, that this is sitting right here. I want to eat that. So Go ahead and eat it. I'm I not going to eat it. I just want you to eat it. It is pretty. I want you to eat it. <laughs> Man, you want some more rice? Mm. Want some more of the green sauce? No, I'm good. good okay, oh, see, Philly people, I told y'all, don't get mad at me. When I went there, that's what they gave me. And I was like, huh? You should have saw my face like, nah, I'm good, son. So good, y'all. Oh, man. If I, if I say so myself, so good. Right, I'm going to try to save this teeny, teeny bit of green. All sauce. right, next time I'm in Philly, I'm going to hold y'all people to it. When the world opens back up and I make my way towards Philly, I'm going to hit y'all up for this real cheese steak y'all keep talking about. I want my cheese steaks and I want my cheese steak. I want both of them, cheesecake and cheese steak. Do you have a little smaller one up there? I don't know. I got to blow my nose now, though. That okay. season when my nose is itching. You want me to, you want me to um, Yeah, you can have that. All right, hold on. I'll finish talking to everyone. What's up, family? How y'all doing? Did y'all see how simple I did that? It was so easy. That's right. Even a boy could do it. That was me. Um, <laughs> so we appreciate you guys, man, for coming in. I know we had some newbies. We thank you for being new. Um, just to let you know, you're not new anymore. You're part of the family, all right? So next time, you family member. We're going to holler at you. You holler back at us. You uh, introduce people into the group. Real simple to do. If you want the recipe, yes, I added all the recipes on there. Yes, I did, yeah. I added all the recipes to the website, so they are on there. Um, real simple. I just felt like doing something that was almost like something that I like, but I wanted to do my own version of it, so I kind of like this version better. Um um, but but shout outs to Esoteric Restaurant, Virginia Beats. Awesome, awesome, great uh, menu all the time. They have a, um, I'm giving them a shout out right now. They have a, um, their own, um, not farm, we call it, garden, garden, where they make all all this stuff that they get, this produce comes from their own garden. Um, they're about a block from the beach. I wish I could remember the address, but they're called Esoteric. Real nice place. Um, good farm to table type thing, type food, uh, real elevated, uh, food, um, that's still affordable. And that was just my take of esoteric scallops dish, scallops dinner. Um, they are a little more okay, elevated. Maybe they use a mushroom Second. risotto. They actually use the, the um, a miso black sesame sauce. And I, I just went with the green sauce. Um, but thank you guys for the inspiration. Y'all the best. <laughs> B-Mac, you, you missed the dish, but don't worry. You can always play this again, boo. We got you. Alexa said, we got you, Daryl. <laughs> she said, we got y'all. Sherilyn said, hats off for you, Derek. You did great with that dish. Thank you, Sherilyn. Thank you, Tammy Rush. Uh, thank you, Sheila. Joyce said, uh, you just got to know where to go. I got you next time. I don't know what that means, but boom. There you go. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Thank you, February, for um, for purchasing our spice blends. I think you're going to love them. Um, they're all purpose. You can use them as popcorn seasoning. You can use them as rubs. You can use them in recipes like we do. They're great. Once you get our seasons, um, you're probably not going to use any other ones. So just letting you know. They're a little healthier for you. They're um, a lot of herbs and spices, really um, fresh ground, a lot less salt. When we do use salt, we use pink Himalayan sea salt, which is a healthier alternative salt. It is a natural occurring salt it's got 84 trace minerals in it so if you're going to have salt have a little healthier salt is what i say so we love you guys man we have more blends coming out we have more recipes coming out we appreciate you guys 2020 been a trip but look at us we are here how about that y'all we are, look it is august it is like that many more days to to christmas already we got we made it through so thank you guys for always being there. We appreciate you so much. And y'all have a great night. Um, got anything to say other than... Uh -huh. I wasn't playing, y'all. You see this plate? <laughs> this was good. I think she liked it, y'all. I think yeah. I, I made up for the white pizza. Um, so 
light skinned pizza the other night. Yes, you did. <laughs> Susan said the same thing. You made up a pizza. <laughs> I don't like y'all. I do not like y'all. No, I just turned it off. Okay. It's just hot because it was 425. Love yeah. you guys. Okay. Um, thank you for uh, purchasing our spice blends. It means a lot. If you have any questions, hit us up. If you need the gift of groceries, um, um, please also hit us up. Or if you know someone that needs the gift of groceries, just hit us up. We got you covered. We love you. Good night. Have a great one. And y'all can watch this one again as much as you can. And you can also give stars. If you're not watching this live, you know you can give stars after the live. All right? We love y'all. Have a great one. Peace.